One of the questions that I'm often asked, if, if I should put my checking account into my trust, how do I do that? Well, I find, and what we recommend to a lot of our clients, is that they don't change their checks. For example, if you were to look at my wife's and my checks, our checks still read Jim and Gail Roberts. When we go to the grocery store, the clerk only knows us as Jim and Gail Roberts. Rather than changing the name on our checks, what I encourage my clients to do is to change their signature card at the financial institution. By changing the signature card so that our signature card, for example, reads Jim and Gail Roberts Trustees of the Roberts Family Trust, when Gail and I both have passed away, our successor trustee will immediately have access to that money. But yet we don't have to get new checks printed and plus we don't have to deal with the embarrassment of can the bank or excuse me the, the a clerk at a grocery store accept one of our checks. So the point that I want to bring up there are easy ways to handle it if you have questions about how to do it give us a call we'll be happy to help you. Look forward to being with service.